Oh, wow, there's gold in them, our hills. <laughs> this morning, we're heading into the museum with my dad and my 96-year-old grandmother, uh, who was born and raised up here. Watch, there's another step yep. inside there, there right? Yes, I knew that. We're going to try to research out some family stuff and see what kind of memories it brings back for her. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Welcome, Betty. Thank to the you. City Museum. So you remember this building as the administration, as the legislature, as the administration building. Yeah, no, it was never called administration. Never called. Oh, okay. Oh, no. It was always was administration? the administration yeah. building. Yeah. <laughs> Betty St. Jean. She was born uh, near Dawson in 1919, and remembers a very different Dawson than uh, than we have here today. Where did you get the bar? There's something familiar about it. Down on Front Street, and there was an empty there, building right? that had been a saloon, and it had a huge. Must have been this far. Yeah, definitely is this one. Grandma's definitely enjoying herself. And Alex, I think he's getting a little bit of history lesson as well. This is rather a small photograph. It's not every day that we have three generations of uh, family that closely allied to Dawson City visit the museum. So having Betty and Perry and Chris all at once uh, is really, really special. Oh, I love this picture. <laughs> That's Uncle Joe. Yeah, he was a little bugger. <laughs> <laughs> a bit of a hiatus in the middle of our busy end or season, but it's important that she's up here. Thank you so much, Betty. Oh. Like, I, it was really cool. It was a good day. Now let's go to work. <laughs>